my name is Rosa Del Catera. I'm from Chicago, Illinois, and I'm a nurse in the United States. Why did you choose Cusco, Peru, Rosa? I chose to volunteer in Cusco, Peru because I've always been very fascinated by the Peruvian culture and I've always wanted to travel to Machu Picchu. It's always been a big dream of mine. And after finishing nursing school this past August, I wanted to give back to a community and volunteer as well as um, gain some experience and I thought Cusco, Peru would be the perfect place to do that. Why did you choose the broader view? I chose a broader view because I am actually a part of a nursing organization called uh, Sigma Theta Tau and they recommended a broader view as a good um, place to do organization to do a medical mission trip with and as I researched through the website and through various social media aspects I really saw that the volunteers were immersed in the culture and immersed with the people and so that's why I really wanted to come with a broader view. How has your experience been so far? My experience has been great in Cusco. Um, I have done so much at the clinic and I feel like I got to help so many people. The first week I was doing well baby checkups with little kids and I really enjoyed that and really saw a wide variety of uh, developmental stages of little kids. And then the second week that I was here volunteering, I worked in a place called Topico in the clinic where I really got to do a wide variety of nursing skills like um, intermuscular injections and wound dressings. And I feel like I was really able to give back to the community. Um, the experience outside of the clinic has been great. Also, I've been able to travel on the weekends and in the afternoon, and I've gone to Machu Picchu, I've seen all the sites, and I've really had a great experience. And what's the best part of the program for you? Um, the best pro part of the program was definitely living with the host family. I feel like um, a lot of other medical mission trips that you can go on, you just live with the other medical personnel and you don't really get as immersed in the culture. But I feel like living with a host family was great because I got to really connect with them and connect with the daily life of a Peruvian person as well as um, in the clinic. I really got to be immersed in the culture and see how medicine is very different here than in the U.S. Did you get all the support you needed from the ABV in Cusco and in the United States? Yes, I feel like I definitely got support. Beatrice was great while I was here. Mm -hmm. I did have some, um, a little bit of trouble. I got pickpocketed on the bus and my phone um, was stolen, but she was great and supported me throughout that entire process. And I felt like whenever there was a little bit of a complication that did come up, because of course you have to be um, prepared for anything, that I got the support I needed and was really able to um, have that resource in the country. Um, before I came, I definitely felt like a broader view supported me and was there checking in with me, making sure I was um, making all the reservations and had everything up to date so that when I came to Peru, I was completely ready to be immersed in the culture and just dive right in. How would you rate to the family accommodations and meals? I absolutely love my host family. I could not say anything bad about them. The accommodations were super comfortable, super easy, um, and the meals were great. I loved everything. I lived with a woman named Cecilia and she was a baker, so I got lots of treats and uh, lots of good, very good food and I enjoyed the entire experience immensely. Would you give any advice to future volunteers coming with us? Um, some advice, I would say definitely keep your personal belongings very close to you because you always hear stories about people getting pickpocketed, but you never think it's gonna happen to you, but it definitely does happen, um, especially if you're taking local transportation. Another thing I would say is in the clinic, uh, definitely speak up and just kind of let them know that you know you do have skills and you're not just um, there to just kind of observe 
and just kind of jump right in. I think that a little bit at the beginning I was kind of nervous and I didn't know because of the language barrier what exactly um, I was allowed to do, what I wasn't allowed to do. So um, the more volunteer work that I did there, the more I would just jump right in and it was definitely great when I did and they allowed me to. So that's my advice. Would you recommend to Broadview? I would. I would there? definitely recommend a broader view to my friends, to other um, people thinking about going into medicine. I think it's great to come to another country and really get immersed in the culture and really volunteer as well as travel. You kind of get to do both in one experience and I feel like it definitely makes that experience much more meaningful. Great. Rose, thank you so much for being with us. Oh.